Didžiausia krepšinio šventė Lietuvoje. Kovo 29 dieną Siemens Arenoje, Vilniuje, pagrindinį šventės rimėjęs Orakulas. Bilietus platina. Tiketa. Rauna iš viršaus ir užvedinėja pieno žvaigždžių aistruolius. Geriausių beko LKL sausio mėnesio žaidėjų buvo pripažintas pasvalio pieno žvaigždžių legionieris Aleksandris Orijaki. Per ketverias sausio mėnesio sužaistas rungtynes vidurio polės ir rinko po 18 su pusė naudingumo balo. Amerikietis padėjo savo komandui laimėti visus keturis susitikimus ir buvo apdovanotas Turkish Airlines MVP prizu. Jūs 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 And I fell in love. That was what I said I wanted to do for the rest of my life. And as I got older, I got taller. You know, thank God I was able to, you know, get tall. And I was able, I was getting recruited from, you know, schools all over the country in America. And then I was able to win in college and have a good college career. And, you know, a lot of my coaches said you can play for a living. And, you know, that's, that's what I wanted to do for my whole life. NCAA, it was a good time of your life? Oh, it was the best time of my life. You know, I was able to play with a lot of great players. I was able to win a national championship. So, you know, that's something I get to take you know, with me for the rest of my life. And a lot of people can't say they did that. So I had a great time. After that, after good, uh, successful uh, years in the NCAA, uh, you was drafted in the uh, NBA. What was the feeling? Oh, man, it was, it was unbelievable, you know. You work so hard your whole life, and then that moment comes down. You know, sometimes you don't know if you're going to get picked. And when they call my name, you know, I was I was happy. I was I felt like I was the happiest guy in the world. Right now, Sacramento Kings have my rights. I'm basically I'm basically property of them. I can't sign with no NBA team but the Sacramento Kings. But their roster, they had too many people, so they wanted me to come overseas as well. And you know, I'm just making the the most of it. And yeah, now you live in a Pasvali. <laughs> <laughs> it's a really small town. Oh my, it's it's extremely small. It's I mean you get to you get to know the people around and you know it's a very small place but you know you eat, sleep, train, you just play basketball. But I kind of like living in places like that because I just focus on my basketball. Uh, you know what means uh, Pianus Vegas? Milk, so, right? It's, it's yeah. milk, right? Milk, milk stars. Milk stars, yeah, yeah. <laughs> what was the, your expression when you find out? Or? I mean, I didn't really know, but when I heard it was milk stars, it was kind of weird. But I just said, you know, let's just play basketball. But yeah, it was kind of strange. But as long as we win, they can call us whatever they want. <laughs> 2011 meto NCAA čempionui Lietuva nebuvo negirdėta šalis. A lot of people they 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 don't I don't know why they don't know. I know it because I watched basketball. I knew Lenis Klaza, Jonas Valančiūnas. I knew the basketball was was good, top notch. But other than that, I didn't know what to expect. I didn't know. And I remember when I first got to Vilnius, I was like, this is nice. Everybody spoke English. I was like, okay, I could do this. It's it's nice. When you when you go to the shops, people just stare like this. They look at you like they've never seen you before, but I understand because I'm tall and I'm, a, I'm an African American and there's not a lot of African American in past relief, but they stare. But some of the people I know now and I wave and, you know, it's friendly people. It's, it's a nice place to live. Let's say, for example, your agent call you and say we have a very good offer and uh, you heard the country's name and you would say, no, 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 I don't want to go there. I mean, if it's a good offer, you can't say no. So maybe Iraq. Uh... Oh, Iraq, nah. <laughs> nah. Nope, not doing it. Oriaki puikiai atsiliepė apie lietuvišką virtuvę, moteris bei pademonstravo lietuvių kalbos žinias. I love Lithuanian food. I don't even know what I'm eating sometimes, but I love it. I eat it all the time. We have a cafeteria that I eat chicken roast, mushrooms, cheese. I love the food. I can't complain about the food. What about the Lithuanian girls? Oh, they're beautiful. Oh my goodness, Lithuanian women are... <laughs> they're beautiful. They're, they're they're very nice looking women. I, I can say that. Cause I know a little little Lithuanian too. I'm I'm trying. I know Labas, Achu. And uh, the bad word. Yeah, I know the bad word. <laughs> I hear my teammates say it all the time. I won't say the bad words, but I know Labas, Achu, Prashal, uh, Ate. What this prize means to you? Oh, this is this is this is uh, great. I didn't even know I got it. 
until you know some of my teammates told me I didn't even expect to get it. I just I just work hard and I play hard and you know when you when you work hard good things happen. So you know my teammates, my coaches, they put me in the right position to to do well. So you know it's it's a blessing. You know I'm, I'm thankful. Puikiai šiame truktiniaujančiam Amerikiečiui 2013-14 metų sezonas nebuvo rožėmis klotas. Yeah, I went to France in the development league, then I got traded in the development league. You also was in Israel. Yeah, I was in Israel for a little bit. It was just, it was crazy. So I'm just happy I'm in one place right now, and I just want to stay in Lithuania <laughs> and finish in Lithuania. But yeah, it, it was crazy, but I just always work hard because it's only so many things you can control as a basketball player, but it was it, was, it wasn't easy going everywhere. But you know, this year I'm just happy I'm in one place. I have a home in Lithuania, coaches, good teammates, and you know everything is fine. What now is uh, the main goal for you and for your team? Oh, we want to obviously win as much games as possible. But me and Mike, we talk all the time. We we want to win the LKO championship. You know, it's, why are you practicing every day? You want to win, but you know th those are our goals. We just got to take it one game at a time and get better and you know we want to beat Zalgiris bad we had we was close but we want to get him again but we just want to keep working and we we want to win the whole thing